Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW Personal Points Plan. Happy holidays, it is officially the holidays. We are just a couple of weeks away from Christmas, which is absolutely crazy. And it is one of my favorite times of year at Trader Joe's. They have such great holiday goodies. I always fill my Christmas Eve and Christmas Day table with all of their holiday goodies. So I am here today to share with you everything that is available now at Trader Joe's. Now keep in mind things sell out rather quickly. So all the products that I'm sharing with you today are currently available get to Trader Joe's as fast as you can because they sell out super, super fast. I picked up a few items for my holiday events that we're going to taste test together here today. And then I'm going to share with you all of the other holiday items that I didn't pick up. Let's be honest, I don't need all the holiday goodies in my house, nor can myself and my husband and even my family on the holidays eat everything. But I'll also be sharing the points for everything in today's video. So if you're excited to see what's up for the holidays at Trader Joe's, give this video a big, huge thumbs up. And if you're new, or you haven't yet subscribed, I would love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell next to it so you never miss a single video. I upload five days a week, so you definitely don't wanna miss out. Check out that description box down below for the 2022 calendar. Track your life, your goals, water, self-care, activity, and your food all in one place. It is the only calendar that you need for 2022. It is limited edition. It is almost sold out. So definitely pick one up for yourself. And P.S. It makes a great gift for someone on a healthy lifestyle journey. Also, you're going to find nutrition coaching where I offer personalized macros and calories as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching, my four recipe eBooks, links, discounts to my favorite things, and another community that you should come over and join is my Facebook group. We'd love to have you over there as well. So I got a bag of Trader Joe's holiday goodies to taste test and lots and lots of good stuff to talk about. So let's jump in. To do the taste test portion of today's video first. Like I mentioned, I didn't buy every single holiday thing at Trader Joe's. It's just too much for my little family to consume. And just like last year, I ended up taking a couple of platters of sweet treats to my real estate office, which is my intention again this year. So all these goodies just aren't left at my house for me to graze on and eat throughout the entire next month. After we taste test everything, I'm going to pop up on the screen all of the other current holiday products at Trader Joe's. Some are food, some are not. There's some really good gift ideas there as well as some even decor types of things there as well. So we have lots of holiday Trader Joe's goodness to go over. So let's jump in to taste test product number one. So these are one of my all-time favorite goodies at Trader Joe's during the holidays. These are the dark chocolate covered peppermint creams. It says soft, creamy, and minty bites. You can have two of these for 110 calories. It is like a York peppermint patty with a chocolate candy cane coating. They are absolutely delicious. I remember these being so good last year that I'm excited to try them again this year. So here is what they look like. I mean, those look amazing. Mm. So there's the inside. Like I said, it's pretty similar to a York peppermint patty with the chocolate candy cane coating. So good. So pepperminty. So good. These would make really cute little additions to like a holiday charcuterie board or disperse these amongst all your cookie platters. Really, really good. Now these were a staple for me last holiday season. And these are the mini peppermint meringues. You can have 11 of these for 80 calories. Meringues are a really good sweet treat option. They're usually low in calories, low in fat, and they just kind of melt in your mouth. So here's the size of them. And remember, you can have 11 of these for the serving. They do have little bits of candy canes in them. Hmm. It just melts in your mouth and then you get that little bit of a crunch from the little candy cane pieces. These are really good. 11 of them is generally a little too much for me. So I usually have about a half a serving. 
but they're low calorie, low point, really good sweet treat. These are absolutely the cutest things ever. These are the decked out tree cookies with milk chocolate filling, white chocolate drizzle, and festive sprinkles. So here is what they look like. There is eight cookies total. They're pretty good sized. Each cookie is 130 calories, so not bad at all. Here's what the actual cookie looks like. It is coated in chocolate on the back. Mmm. You can also see that they're filled with chocolate. These are really good. They have that butteriness of a shortbread and they're crunchy, but the chocolate in the middle is soft. Super, super good. Really good flavor. Really good sized cookie for 130 calories. And again, how cute would these be on a cookie platter? I have to say these are probably my favorite thing to come out at Trader Joe's for the holidays. These are the Candy Cane Jojo. So they are like an Oreo, but the inside of these is a vanilla cream with candy cane chunks in it. And I love peppermint anything. You'll definitely see a theme of peppermint here. These are pretty high in calories. Two cookies is 140 calories. And of course, here is what the cookie looks like. And here's the inside. So you can see those little bits of peppermint. Cheers. These are definitely as good as I remember. I just get that crunch of the candy cane and it just brings this chocolate peppermint goodness. These are, I have to say, like I said, one of my favorite things that comes out over the holidays. In the At the end of the video, you'll see that they also have these in gluten-free. So if you're gluten-free, you don't have to miss out on the deliciousness of the peppermint Jojo's. Since we're talking peppermint, let's go to the candy cane chocolate covered almond. I think I bought these last year, but I don't remember. I don't remember for sure if I bought these last year. I think that I did. So here's what they look like. So they they are like candy coated almonds with peppermint. You can have nine almonds for 160 calories. So here's the size of the almond. It says roasted almonds dipped in dark chocolate, then enrobed in white chocolate and covered with candy cane bits. I mean. Hmm. So delicious. I get chocolate, I get white chocolate, and then you get that punch of peppermint from the candy cane and the little crunchiness from the candy cane bits. These are delicious. And again, how cute would these be added to a holiday charcuterie board or put in a fun little festive bowl out on the table? We will definitely eat these up over the holidays. Next up are these English toffee bits. Now, I love English toffee. I love the Heath Bar. Who remembers the Heath Bar? I think they still sell that candy bar. It's so good. This is a crunchy, buttery center enrobed in a chocolatey coating and sprinkled with chopped nuts. It is seven pieces for 160 calories. Let's see the size of these pieces. They are pretty small, but again, you can have seven of these for the points in calories. So buttery, so chocolatey. One thing I want to point out too is this little bag is two servings. So seven pieces for the points in calories. So good. So here's a new product. I believe this is new this year. These are the peppermint brownies. And these say with white chocolate chips and white ganache drizzle. Oh my goodness. Each brownie is 130 calories. I'm gonna open this up and show you the size. They are fairly small, but you can have a brownie for 130 calories. So here's the size. They're actually pretty thick, pretty good sized for 130 calories. Smells so good. And these are so soft. It was hard for me to get the brownie out of the little package. So I can't wait to give this a try. Okay, Trader Joe's. I see you. These are incredible. Chocolatey, there's even chocolate chips in the brownie itself, and you get this wash of peppermint flavor. These are really good. I have to say this is probably the best thing that I've tried today in beating out the JoJo's, which is saying a lot. They're soft, they're chewy, they're chocolatey. Wow, these are really, really dangerous and really, really delicious. A holiday staple for me are these mini gingerbread people. I remember these being so good last year. 
They're gingerbread cookies with a white fudge icing. You can have four cookies for 150 calories. These are all of your gingerbread people, gingerbread cookie dreams come true. So here's what they look like. They're pretty good size and they do have like a white chocolate coating on the back. And again, you get four of these for 150 calories and the points. So good. You get punched in the face with ginger. So if you don't like crystallized candied or ginger in general, you're definitely not going to like these because they are very ginger forward, but they're balanced really nice with the white chocolate. They're crunchy. These are so good. Why are these so good? I'm definitely going to have to bring a lot of this stuff to my real estate office and get it out of my house pronto because it is all so delicious. And I thought we could round out today's taste test portion with something relatively healthy. This is the brand new holiday crisp protein bar from Bear Bells. These bars are really good. They have tons of hype around them. And this is the protein bar holiday crisp with caramel flavor. There's 20 grams of protein and no added sugar. The bar is 200 calories. And then of course I'll put the points here on the screen for you. So here's what it looks like. Oh my gosh, that looks so delicious. That's good. That's really good. These little crunchy bits on top, they kind of remind me of Rice Krispies, but crunchier. They add a good texture element to this bar. I definitely taste the chocolate layer and the caramel layer. This is really good. And if you want something sweet, satisfies that whole holiday craving, this may be a really good option and you can't beat it for 20 grams of protein. So that is everything that I picked up for my household from Trader Joe's for the holidays. I'm already feeling this overload of sugar and I didn't even eat everything. I just took a bite for you guys, but that's a lot. I definitely am going to enjoy these goodies over the holidays and then the rest of it. It's getting out of my house so that it's not a temptation after the actual holiday because it's not a Halloween week or a holiday month. It's a holiday. Now I want to share with you all the other holiday goodies at Trader Joe's. So I'm going to put some fun Christmas music to the photos, pop them up here on the screen for you. And then of course I will put the points related to the item as well for you. So you know exactly how many points everything is. And this is literally everything that Trader Joe's had or my Trader Joe's had for this holiday season. So you can add all of these goodies to your list for your next Trader Joe's trip. So let's go ahead and roll in to all the other Trader Joe's goodies. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I'm telling you why. why? Santa Claus is coming to town. He's making a list, he's checking it twice He's gonna find out who's naughty or nice Santa Claus is coming to town He sees you when you're sleeping He knows when you're awake He knows if you've been bad or good So be good for goodness sake Oh, you better not cry, you better not cry You better not pout, I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to town. The little tin horns, the little boy drums, booty doot doots and mama dum dums. Santa Claus is coming to town. And curly head dolls, the cuddle and coo, elephant boats and kitty cars too. Santa Claus is coming to town. He sees you when you're sleeping, he knows when you're awake, he knows if you've been bad or good, so you better be good for goodness sake. You better watch out, you better not cry, you better not cry, I'm telling you why, Santa Claus is coming to town. sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows if you've been bad or good, so be good for goodness sake. You better watch out. You better not cry. 
you better what pa I'm, I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to town You better, better watch, watch out, out. You, you better, better not cry You better, better not pout I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to so much for joining me on today's Trader Joe's holiday haul and taste test. I hope you enjoyed seeing my first impression of some of their holiday goodies as well as all of the other good stuff that they currently have in store. Like I mentioned, they sell out rather quickly, so run, don't walk to your Trader Joe's and pick up anything on your holiday wish list. If you enjoyed today's video and the taste test, give it a big huge thumbs up. And of course, if you're new or you're watching and you're not subscribed, I would love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Check out the description box down below for the 2022 calendar. Don't start your new year without it, and it makes a fantastic gift for anybody on a healthy lifestyle journey. You're also going to find my four recipe eBooks, nutrition coaching, and of course, don't forget to join us on Facebook. That community would love to have you be part of it. Happy holiday, my friends. Happy holidays, friends. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you all in tomorrow's meal prep. Bye.